All right, we're taking a look here at remote backends for the enhanced backend type. And a remote backend uses the Terraform platform, which is either Terraform Cloud or Terraform Enterprise. Uh, by default, I usually just say Terraform Cloud when I'm referring to the Terraform platform, but just to understand there is a distinction between Terraform Cloud and Terraform Enterprise, Enterprise being the on-premise um, offering, okay? So with a remote backend, when Terraform Apply is performed via the CLI, the Terraform Cloud run environment is responsible for executing the operation. So that's what you get when you get Terraform Cloud, you get this run environment. So it's basically just a built-in uh, code build server uh, to run Terraform commands for you. One thing I really want you to know about remote backends, because this really tripped me up uh, when I was actually trying to make the follow along, which is the fact that because the Terraform Cloud run environment is the one executing the command, your provider credentials need to be configured in the environment variables in Terraform Cloud. So, you know, if you had a project and you configured it with um, TF VARs locally, and then you were to swap out your remote backend, uh, it's not going to work the way you expect it to because, um, again, the Terraform Cloud run environment is not going to take your credentials and then move them to the cloud. Okay, you have to do that yourself. Um, when using a remote backend, you need to set a Terraform Cloud workspace. So you would uh, go ahead and go to Terraform Cloud and just go create one. You can create one or multiple ones for a single project. If you use a single workspace for a project, you're just going to use the workspaces uh, name. And if you set multiple workspaces via prefix, uh, you can use a prefix. Okay. And the way this prefix works is that you're going to say like my app or something. And when you go to run Terraform Apply, what it's going to do is prompt you to say which environment do you want to use. So, uh, th and this is what you've created in your Terraform Cloud workspace. You've created one called Dev. You created one called Pro uh, Prod, and saying which workspace do you want to deploy to? I want you to know that uh, you can only set uh, either name or prefix. You can't set both, okay? So just understand that.